going to do it for my shin wizard, all right, because just watching the amount of wrestling I watch, seeing the guys, my guys, other guys that we compete against, this shin wizard is 90% lock it down stalemate. There's no, I'm going to shin wizard and use this to an advantage to score a takedown, okay? That's a bad mentality to have. Now, sometimes I get it. There might be that small percentage of the time where I do need to just hang on for a stalemate and get a fresh start. That shouldn't be the norm by any stretch. So what we're going to do is we're going to start down on the mat in a shin wizard. And we'll talk about the mouse trap and stuff like that tomorrow. But what I want to talk about today is a shin wizard and why it works and how it should work and what this guy's reaction is going to be when I do get this shin wizard. Now, when we end up in a shin wizard, it's usually because this guy's running the corner. If I got him beat up, just relax, if I got him beat up front, there shouldn't be a reason why he gets to a shin with him. It's when he gets to the corner, he's got shoulder pressure, and it's here. I've got a shin wizard to stop him from circling and covering my legs. So that's where this defense comes from. I reach down in between my body and his, I grab my sock. Now, what's problematic about where his hands are at right now? Above my knee. Free hand off the grip. Now, this is where we got to make sure we're all on the same page with our shin wizard. Outside foot up, turn my knee away. My forearm should be driving in his armpit. My knee should be turned away like the hand on the clock, and I'm trying to trap his head to the mat. Okay? Keep your head up. I should be able to trap his head to the mat right here. This isn't a shin wizard. I got no pressure here. He'll be able to win that every time. Now, what these guys will do when we lock this shin wizard down is a lot of times they'll change knees and shelf my leg to his inside thigh. Here. Everybody see what he did? Do it again. Go back down. Turn, 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 turn. So I got a shin wizard. I've got him locked out. He's going to bring his right knee to his left knee. Then he's going to step his left knee up and pull my shin up on top of his thigh. All right. Now, when he does this, takes my shin wizard out of the equation. What we're gonna do when he gets to this position is we're gonna let go of our shin wizard. I'm gonna take my shin wizard hand and swim it all the way across my body. See how I turn my belt buckle away, turn my inside hip down. And at this point, I'm driving off the instep of my foot and I'm ripping my foot up under my chest. And then I'm gonna turn and face and wrestle him, okay? But again, this skill is something that, yeah, it's not going to score us a takedown, but it can save us a big, big, big takedown sequence if this guy's really running the corner on me. Okay? So single leg. I'm cranking my shin wizard here. He goes inside shelf, right in this position. Shin wizard hand comes out. Watch how I rotate my body. This foot, I'm just rotating my instep down. Watch my left foot. As I swim over, instep. Watch how far my chest moves. Right here. Okay? Chest didn't move, and then I'm turning and facing. Now, we'll, we'll pass a leg from here. We'll do our mousetrap from here. We'll do some other stuff from this position. But right now, all we're doing is getting kick out reps in. All right? So it might be something he shoots a single leg. I'm battling in here. I rake up cover. He starts beating me to the corner. Shin wizard. I beat the grip. I start beating him here. He goes inside shelf, and then I kick out and turn. Okay? I'm back on my feet. I'm ready to dance. All right? We're not evading. We're not running away. We're just adjusting the position. He's starting to steadily beat my position. I've got to get a fresh start and get back to my feet. Like I said, that position won Bessie Kadukov a freaking world title just because he had that skill set of getting his legs skinny and slippery and getting it back so he could be in control. Questions? So again, on that shelf, I'm on the single, outside knee, comes inside knee, post, pull the leg up to that inside shelf. That's when we start turning and kicking out. Play there, go. Let's get it. Inside.